Skadoosh, skadoosh, and welcome back to the channel. I'm Joey Moss with Bad Boy Gaming. We're going to crack open a Chaos Six Pack and a Guilds of Ravnica bundle for Jacob Arspang. Jacob, do appreciate your love and support for the channel. Thank you for being a patron. It's a little past overdue. My apologies for that, sir. But I'm going to make sure that we get these out to you. So the Chaos Six Pack, as you guys know, it features six assorted boosters from recent Magic sets and one promo card. These can be found at your local Walmart. Uh, typically, you're going to pull Athalia's Lancers. 99.9% .9 of the time, that's what I've been pulling out of these, which is pretty god-awful. And then also, we're going to open up the Guilds of Ravnica for Jacob. Let's crack that open first, see what you get, my dude. Dude, good luck, sir. Also, tonight, what a crazy day. What a crazy night. A very boring Super Bowl. I don't know who all watched that, but Goat Lives Matter and the goat took it home yet again. Unbelievable. Uh, if you guys watched that, I do apologize um, for uh, the NFL Network because, man, it was just boring as all get out. Um, until the very end, there was a little bit of excitement. It would have been fun to see the Rams come back and do something, but it just didn't happen that way. Uh, so you get one of these little booklets. That's good stuff. You get one of these little boxes, and that's fun. Don't steal. Bad things will happen. Ankle grabbing, and your mama's going to be having to knit you a sweater so you can wear it to keep warm because your your legs are tucked, and you're getting it from behind. Don't steal is, the, is, is, is what I'm saying here. Thank you for Saved by the Bell. All right. Love Zach Morris. What a guy, huh? All right, let's get a four. A 17. I was tricked. I was bamboozled, yeah, I tell you, bamboozled. So we got all these lovely gills of Ravnica booster packs to open. Thanks for tuning in so late. You're going to get some foil lands as well. Pretty freaking sweet. Mr. Jacob, good luck to you, sir. Thank you for your love and support for Bad Boy Gaming. All right, so let's do this. Who has purchased a bundle? If you did, what'd you pull? Did you get anything good out of it? Did you get crap out of it? I'd like to hear all about that. Great card. It lived up to expectation. Healer's Hawk is just phenomenal. It's a card that I, I uh, definitely gave praise to, and for good reasons. Uh, we got the Affectionate Blah and the Sting and the Omni Spell Adept. I was hoping to see this, this take off a little bit. I still want to make a deck around it. Uh, probably a blue and red build. Uh, a blue and red build that just, uh, you drop crazy huge spells is, is primarily the goal of that deck. Um, we'll see how it takes off. I'm going to try to do something, and uh, hopefully we have some fun with it. And you got the Night Veil vale Predator, the Goblin Crater Maker, the Dart and Drowned Secrets. With the Foil Command the Storm. Get a load of that. That's a gorgeous looker. That is a gorgeous looking foil. It's like the plasma shooting out of them. That's right, sound effects. They're pretty good, I know. Thank you. Full credit to uh, the Hollywood studio team there. That's been uh, doing it. Also, if you guys haven't checked out, we opened up collector's packs. Collector edition booster packs from Ravnica Allegiance. Go back one video. It'll blow your mind if you haven't seen the video yet. They are a thing. Pretty nuts. The Welp Amara, Soul of the Accord, is a rare. All right. I do like that card. It is pretty good, especially in those Convoke builds. You can really take your opponent to Pound Town uh, pumping out tokens really quick. Heck, a lot of fun. Got the Centaur, Golgari Raiders, the Whispering Snitch, Equinauts, and Experimental Frenzy is the rare. Experimental Frenzy is a pretty solid rare there. Let's get a Mythic, baby. Let's get a Mythic, Jacob. Good luck. And Vince, I haven't forgot about you, buddy. I got your box here. It's it's been forever. I'm sorry, Vince. I'll get it. I'll get around to it this week. I do promise you, Vince. Skadoosh, Vince. Oh, we pull the Mythic as predicted. Aurelia Exemplar of Justice with the Foil Legion Guild Mage in the back. What a pack right there. Skadink! Oh, my God. That is a good pack right there. Anyone would be happy with that. Beautiful artwork with the flames, um, the flame sword all up on the ground carving out that crazy, I don't know what kind of devil worshiping stuff's going on there, but it's pretty nasty. Awesome pool there, man. With a soldier token and Boris Guildgate out the back entrance. Disdainful stroke. Disdainful stroke. We got the Lux. We got the, we got the, we got the Marshal. The Giant, the Riot, the Giant Riot with the Response Resurgence. Fun how that played along, huh? And Celestia Guildgate. Nice. This pack seems a little bundled up here. I'm not sure what's going on with the bundling here. All right, so what do you got? We got the Sure Strike. We have Trooper, the Rager, Rock Charger, the Drake, Surveillance, and Guild Mages Forum. Not bad. Not a bad card. Could have done a little better there, but it's all right. It's all right. Got to pull the got to pull the bulk to get to the goods, man. 
got to pull the bulk to get to the good stuff. I'm just happy you got that Mythic Angel. It's pretty gorgeous. Price of Fame. Cool card. Ooh, nice. Plague Crafter. There it is. Steam Vents. There you go. Solid hit right there with the Steam Vents. Anyone wants a, a dual land uh, shocker for sure. Two in the pink, one in the stink, kids. Uh, Might of the Masses, Dragonauts, Book Devourer, and Legion Warboss. Really cool card. I made a deck using this, and it's actually not doing too bad. I uh, got the Guildgate and the Elf Knight token out the back. All right. What are you going to get for the last pack, buddy? Maximize Altitude. Any foil luck? We got for our uncommons Beam Splitter Mage, the Book Devourer, World Soul Colossus, Mission Briefing, pretty solid, and a Foil Hired Poisoner. All right, not too bad. You uh, you went home pretty good. Three uh, three decent. Uh, well, you know it is what it is. They're they're not the most amazing. That's a cool card though. I really like the artwork on that. The art on these two combined is pretty sweet. Um, and the one one Death Touch Hired Poisoner is not bad. Uh, but yeah, there you go. You did pull some uh, some foils more than I expected. Um, anytime you pull two or more out of a bundle is pretty good. Here's a rare and uncommon, a rare and uh, mythic recap. The Steam Vents was good. Aurelia was amazing. Experimental Frenzy and Amara, not bad at all. Good, 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 good to you, sir. So let's make a little pile here. I'm going to throw these over here in the good old bundle. Bedink. Commons and uncommons. I'm only sipping you the goodies out of here. So that means anything basically over uh, 50 cents is yours, my friend. Chaos six pack. That's right. Is it worth spending 20 bucks on a Chaos six pack? It's like a two for one video. Give me a skadoosh and a like. I do appreciate it. Let's open this sucker. And we opened up Mythic Edition booster boxes. Uh, two of them, believe it or not. And something actually got destroyed. I know. Might want to go back a couple videos. There is some things that uh, I have uh, given out in those videos for sure. Let's see what our booster packs are. Whoop! Got a little excited there, didn't you, Mr. Box? Hour of Devastation. The Amonkhet. Curator of Mysteries, which is just everywhere. They must have printed like a billion of these. I feel they're more common than a common card, to be honest. Shadows over Innistrad. The Ixalan. Shadows over Innistrad again. So I guess what Shadows over Innistrad is our, our, our plus pack there. Is our uh, modern pack, I believe how it goes, as they would call it. All right, let's get to cracking, Captain. Shadows over Innistrad. Eldritch Moon's definitely better, value-wise. I'd say Ixalan takes the top. Rivals, Amonkhet, Our Shadows, and Shadows over Innistrad. My girl was nice enough to get these for me. And by the way, guys, we don't know if it's going to be a boy or girl. Now, I know I said that in a video, that my son's going to be looking forward to having a baby brother. But we just don't know if it's a boy or girl yet. Uh, I guess let's take a poll. Do you think it's going to be a boy or do you think it's going to be a girl? Um, look right around here to answer that question. <laughs> um, I, I'm happy either way. There you go. But I'd like to know what you guys think. And also, what kind of crazy names are we thinking? I'm open to anything, really. So let's see. Let's hear some names. Nothing stupid, please. Please uh, refrain from the stupidity. But uh, yeah, have some fun with it. Uh, what names do you think? Serious ones, please. Welcome to the Fold is our rare. What does it even do? It's got the Madness, Axe, Induce, Gain Control of Target Creature if its toughness is two or less. If Welcome to the Fold, Madness co uh, cost was paid, instead gain control of that creature if its toughness is extra less. Oh, okay, I get it. And we got a Daring Sleuth and a Kindly Stranger. I think I pulled this not long ago. Look at the artwork on that witch. That's, just, that's very scary, I must say. That is very scary to look at. Pretty cool indeed. So yeah, I'm pumped. Got a baby on the way. And believe me, that baby's going to make some cameos for sure. Some baby cameos on the channel. No doubt about it. Puncturing Light. I haven't opened Innistrad in forever, but man, I did open at least three or four boxes on the channel. The old stuff's crazy. Proceed with caution. Confirm suspicions. Counter target spell. Investigate three times. Holy smokes. And the Lamholt Pacifist. So far, we got two rare blue cards. Unbelievable. On to Mr. Ixalan. Let's see what we get out of Mr. Ixalan. Deadeye Tormenta. That's right. And we got the Dive Down. Forgot that's what, what set it came out of. Verdant Rebirth, The Roar, Archer, and Sanguine Sacrament. I've seen some people um, almost win games with this. Almost. Uh, actually, you could win a game with this, to be honest. 
gain X life and opponent loses X life kind of thing. Fun little trickery. Need some other cards to go with it though in a modern build, but it could win the game. Rivals, is this Rivals yet? Rivals of Ixalan, yep. We know the, the Phoenix is in here. Evolving Wilds, absolutely breathtaking, amazing card. One of my favorites. Enter the Unknown. Golden Demise, great removal. The Reaver, Ezra the Lawbringer, pulled a friggin' Mythic out of there. Heck yeah, very powerful card. But with life gain, of course. Uh, Amonkhet, come on, baby. Come on, Amonkhet. What are we gonna get out of here? Let's get something good. Amonkhet, drop us something stupid. Consuming Fervor, the Crop Mate, Angler Drake, and the Dread Wanderer. Pretty cool card. What a trial of ambition. Dread Wanderer was a fun card in its day uh, in standard. Trial of ambition, not bad for the foil. And we got a Kitty Cat and a Mountain. Last pack to crack, Captain. Let's get some fun. Let's get something good. Fervent Paincaster with the Worthy, the Scarabs, and Earthshaker Kenra. Another powerful card back in the day uh, during standard. Not sure how much play that sees nowadays. Appreciate you guys tuning in. Um, we're going to do some more deck techs coming up this week. Vince, I'll take care of you soon. Jacob, I'll be getting this out to you. I'll probably wait till uh, the patron rewards in case something else comes your way. And, uh, yeah, I appreciate you guys. Make sure you punch the like button. And as always, we'll see you later!